So we're learning more about a familiar face, state epidemiologist Dr. Angela Dunn. She's been a leading voice during the pandemic with daily updates on coronavirus. Michael Lockler sat down one on one with Dr. Dunn. Michael, what'd you find out? We've heard so much about the virus and the state's response from Dr. Dunn that we wanted to learn a little bit more about her. We have the luxury in the state to be able to test anybody. Thousands of Utahns are tuning in for her daily briefings. I was excited to get a few minutes with you because you've kind of become this household name. <laughs> and I'm totally unaware of that because I don't watch any, like I don't, I don't really get on. My husband is my unofficial social media manager. Dr. Angela Dunn tells me she grew up in Texas and Chicago, college in Rhode Island, medical school in Miami, residency in Los Angeles and San Diego. Then five years ago, she moved to Utah. When I started my fellowship with the CDC, it was during the height of the Ebola outbreak. In a rural village in West Africa, Dunn worked on contact tracing and protecting health care workers. So a lot of things that translate to COVID. Dunn has two boys and two dogs, and she's keeping her exercise routine. Stress relief is huge for me. I haven't stepped inside of a grocery store in six weeks. Um, I just don't have time, so I'm very lucky to have a supportive husband who's able to help hold the fort down. She's the state's medical consultant for any public health priorities, and she's become more public during this crisis. Uh, Watch her reaction earlier this month when a technical glitch caused an echo, and she didn't recognize her own voice. Oh, that the, means the ability to get the word out and get information out and facts out to the general public is an essential piece of public health. So if I can be part of that and help people know the truth about what we know and what we don't know, um, I'm happy to play that role. Now take a look at this photo. The state treasurer wanted to snap a photo with Dr. Dunn this afternoon at the Capitol using that, uh, that measuring tape to uh, express the social distancing. Dunn tells me she's been working 12 to 14 hour days and of all the things that we're all missing during this, she misses hugs the most. Live at the Capitol, Michael Locklear, Two news.